So first off, I need a coffee to start the day. Right then guys, we have got our coffee. Welcome back to the channel. Today, as always, is gonna be super exciting because we're doing a bit of a road trip. Let's get into it. Right, so we've come out of the love bus. We are with this man here. If you didn't know that man, you can quite clearly see him <laughs> on the front page of MBUK. I mean, who actually holds all these MBUKs for himself in? shop these days he goes into Mackie D's and he's like yeah hi guys you may recognize me sort from such magazines as that anyway so we're on our way bit of a road trip let's do it we've arrived chop where are we we're at Matt's compound in the middle of nowhere here we are we are in the famous Matt Jones compound the man himself is going to join us in a bit so uh yeah let's Get the bikes out and probably have a good watch of the other two i guess probably the wrong bike choice for the day but we've got our trail bike wish me luck i guess here we are we have arrived at the matt jones sports complex that is terrifying it's so much bigger in real life and today we've got chop with us and as you can see we have got the sky booter so we we'll wait on Matt, he's just filled up the Jenny so he can sort of show us what it's all about and then I guess we we'll get into it very reluctantly. Look at the size of this airbag, it's absolutely massive. Matthew, there he is. Mate, you all right? You've lost a bit of weight, I see. Thank you. And um, where are we then? My compound. What's so special about this compound? It's where it all happened for me. Built it myself with mates. Recently got an airbag last year, so this is Deke's first time seeing the big roll in the nine foot kicker and the airbag, which takes seconds to inflate and he's already got his pads on. So you better get up there, mate. So here we are, I've come to check, check out Matt. I was waiting to go flying off the side then. So all of Matt's videos, honestly, do not give this thing the justice it deserves. That thing is absolutely terrifying. You get to the top and you've literally got no running, you've just got to hop straight in. Now, I ride BMX a bit on a quarter pipe or whatever, super good because you can just pull it up. On a big trail bike, on something like that, it's super, super scary. So I'm gonna watch these guys for a bit longer, see how we get on and then go up there maybe later on. Yo! Straight in. So what advice would you give for this? Well, you're a bit unsure, aren't you? I'm because in it a little, yeah. And everyone says the same, it's because there's nothing around us. But, <laughs> all the places I've ridden with you, Deeks, this would be a fire road, a dusty fire road, and that would be a trail that's like drops in off the side. I'm spitting, I'm that excited. <laughs> and I know for a fact you would drift into this, into wet roots and rocks without even looking, and just jump into that. That's very true. It's grippy, smooth plywood. So well, I'm, I'm watching these boys, watching them do their stuff a couple of times and then wait and see. Yo! Yes, the jump doesn't scare me. This, on all of Matt's videos, does not look how it is in real life. And it probably looks so pathetic on GoPros. But the worrying thing is you have no running and you're literally going from there. Just got to drop straight in with um, no pedaling, so it's pretty gnarly. How are you getting on, Chop? All good? Yeah, first one. Pretty good. <laughs> nice. Generator's just stopped. <laughs> he hasn't done one of those for a long, long time, apparently. Right, so I'm going to wear my full face. Don't know why, really, because um, it's an airbag with a 70 foot roll in. Let's uh, see what happens. Yo! <laughs> oh my god, man! Oh! The build-up! The build-up to that! And it's so f***ing easy! <laughs> Wow! Right, I get it. Full face, no gogs, I know. It's one of those things. Let's go for another run. <laughs> you 
can't land sideways. <laughs> Man, I love it. <laughs> oh mate. A bit yeah, just a bit. Yo. No. Brown fielder dropping in. Oh. So this place super super sick. I'm gonna put a jumper on, not because it's cold, because when you crash on that you get like little carpet burns and I wanna try and you know push the boat out a little so uh Let's get a jumper on, sweat my watsits off and give it a couple more goes of stuff. Right, definitely not a day for a jumper, but I think it's better when you come onto land, you know, you at least glide on your clothing rather than your skin. So let's get back up there, give it another go. <laughs> I nearly lost my foot then. The man, the myth, the legend is now going to drop in on his trail bike. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Did I lose my feet then? No, you lost everything! <laughs> Yeah, got a little carried away that run. Forgot to pinch my seat and just thought, oh, the camera's rolling, let's just take my hands off. And obviously suicides, I'm not an expert, but obviously you need to pinch that seat. Luckily, I've got two slope style legends with me so they can give me little pointers. The better twins arrived! We're not allowed, are we? Sharp a field of dropping in. Mate! <laughs> Mate! That was massive! The MJ, new business venture, eh? New business. <laughs> First paying customer is Ben Deacon. <laughs> so uh, I've hired. Oh, it's actually well I. So sick. So here we are on top of the blue skyscraper. We're in line with Matthew, he's going to drop in and get some shots, man. Yo. Yo. Yes, shot. Right, so Matt, has just told me he generally can't control the crane from down there. So, um, Mr. Novice here, better work some controls out. What an epic day with the boys. So massive thanks to Chops for allowing me to come up with him. Massive thanks to Matt Jones for allowing us to ride his compound. Super, super cool. Something that I wouldn't normally do by any means. It's not exactly a bike park or small little downhill trail or anything like that. And this honestly is so much more gnarly than what I was expecting. You see the videos, it doesn't look all that steep. You come here in re real life and to give you guys an idea, you know, you're nearly chain ringing the, the bike as it goes over. And unlike a normal steep descent, 
you've got a hole either side so if you went over the bars you're falling i don't know 50 60 foot something horrible and it's always one of those where on camera it honestly doesn't do it the justice it deserves that's quite a stinking old rolling it's quite gnarly um we obviously didn't get a chance to ride from the top funny old thing we didn't really want to do that it's even more gnarlier massive thanks to matt for allowing me to ride his compound that sounded juicy so we've had a sick time the airbag is now fully collapsed so thank you all so so much for watching hopefully if you've enjoyed this video it'd be great if you give it a thumbs up be sick if you subscribe and until next one i'll see you in a bit oy, oy.